Chiefs training camp coverage brought to you by Price Chopper. Hi, good evening to everybody. Good evening to you, Krista. The Chiefs veterans arrived here at Chiefs training camp looking good, feeling great, and ready for a Super Bowl run. And why not? This team, well, they have a lot of guys that now have that playoff experience. Many feel like this is their year to win the AFC West division, make that deep postseason run. Now, the rookies held their final early morning practice session today before the full team hits the field Saturday afternoon. We'll talk about that in just a moment here. Now, the Chiefs, they'll be without running back Jamal Charles. The team, well, they announced that he will start camp on the physically unable to perform list. Now, that means Sharkandrick West will be the feature back with Spencer Ware behind him. West, well, he had one word for the kind of relationship he and Charles have, and that word is... Outstanding. I mean, I wouldn't be where I am today if it wasn't for Jamal. So, I mean, I'm very blessed and fortunate to have him as a friend, as a brother, as a teammate. I mean, every guy in that room has helped me be to where I am today. All right. As for tomorrow, that first official training camp practice will be 3.30 Saturday afternoon. It's completely open to the public, but it is $5. What's $5? Come on out and watch the Chiefs as they get set to make their first push towards the playoffs and hopefully to the Super Bowl. Reporting from Chiefs training camp here in St. Joseph, Missouri, I'm Ryan Marshall, 41 Action News. A tough assignment, Ryan. Now, you told us we need $5, but if fans are going tomorrow, what can they bring? What can they not bring? I know there's some rules. Well, you can bring a little bit of comfortable clothing and some sunscreen, first of all, because it's going to be a little bit warm outside, as J.D. Rudd did say a little bit earlier, and you definitely want to be protected from that sun. Also, you can bring helmets, jerseys. There's going to be an autograph session. You can bring baseball cards, things that you, you'll definitely want to have signed. Then you can also bring one 20-ounce factory-sealed bottle of water because the Chiefs, they say they're going to have concessions out there, so they're only going to permit one bottle of water. But those things are the rules, and that's where we stand as far as uh, things that fans can bring. All right. Back to the you. Black Sharpie for those autographs, if you're lucky. Thanks, Ryan.